Well, Kenan, tonight, area health departments all over our region are preparing for the very first clinics starting tomorrow that will be open to the general public. And up until now, it's only been available to those at-risk groups. H1N1 vaccines have been trickling into area health departments this fall, but it hasn't been enough to cover everyone who wants to be vaccinated. That's why, until now, only at-risk groups, such as pregnant women, children, health care workers, and the chronically ill, have been priority. Now health officials are opening the doors to anyone who wants the vaccine. Monday, Montgomery County will hold its first public clinic open to everyone at Hera Arena. Miami County will be vaccinating at Miami Valley Center Mall in Piqua at the same time. Then on Tuesday, Clark and Greene Counties will follow, along with Shelby County, which will hold a clinic at Sydney Middle School. The response is still mixed. Some say they've been waiting for their chance, while others say they're still not sure about getting the vaccine. I don't know. Why am I not getting it? I'm not getting it because I've had the flu shot and we wash our hands and my one son actually already had it. And what we understand is that it's um, not going to be that bad if you get it. And we'll just be aware of the symptoms. It just doesn't make sense not to. It's, you know, it's such a problem going on right now and people have been so sick. I, you know, I don't think, I don't see any good reason not to if they're offering them to the public. The Center for Disease Control reports the number of H1N1 cases is falling. But doctors say the vaccine is still important to help prevent another wave of illnesses. Manufacturers are making 10 million doses a week. But even at that rate, it could be spring before there's enough for everyone. Well, experts say they do believe that the falling number of H1N1 cases has to do with the fact that so many people have gotten vaccinated already. They also say that this year more people have gotten the regular flu vaccine. Reporting live in Dayton, I'm Holly Samuels, 2 News on your side.